About 20 years ago, I got a job as a model for figure drawing classes in college. You know those classes where people sketch uh, somebody wearing no clothes for research purposes? Yeah, so I, I was one of those guys. Why did I take this job? Because it scared me. I was terrified of the idea and I was suffering from a horrible case of social anxiety. So I decided to face my fears head on. Now, this is not about social anxiety, it's about seeing with these eyes and with this one and all the others. So, I noticed something very strange. When I looked at the drawings of me that the students in this class would make, there was a guy and a girl sitting next to each other, looking supposedly at the same thing, me. And afterward, I, I took a peek at their drawings. And the girl had drawn this picture of a completely emaciated skeleton of a man, skin and bones. It looked like a concentration camp survivor. And I thought, wow, do I really look like that? I'm so thin, so ghastly weak. I looked to my left and saw the young man's picture of me. And I saw something right out of a comic book. This muscular figure with muscle striations popping out all over with abs and a six pack and these little muscles right there and everything. And I was like, wow, I don't look like that, do I? And I looked to the right, I looked to the left and I realized, wait, how is it that these two people looking at the same subject could get something completely different and polar opposite out of the experience? Well, here's the thing. We don't all see the same things. Our eyes are not cameras. The connection between our brain and our body and our eyes, it doesn't work like a high definition recording. What you're seeing right now, right here, it's not definitive. It's not even objective. How many comments I've heard in my videos saying, I love when you give a dramatic pause. <sighs> and stop to take a breath. And how many others I've heard would say, man, why don't you edit out the pauses? It's, it's too much, I can't stand it. Because some people have a very different perspective. But here's the thing, my friends, be genuine. Be honest with yourself. Because ultimately, it's you that you have to live with. What other people see in you is not necessarily you. You're not necessarily the thin skeleton of a man and you're not necessarily the comic book character with the giant muscles. Maybe the truth is somewhere in between and maybe it's neither extreme. Maybe it's a completely different extreme. If we allow ourselves to dictate our actions based on the opinions of people who do not matter to our personal development, then what are we? Puppets. Open up these eyes, open up that one. And realize that seeing is not believing, my friends. Believing, on the other hand, is seeing. What you believe, you will see. 